In this video, I'm going to show you how to fix no sound on your HP laptop. So if you can't hear any sound from your HP laptop or speakers, then the first thing we need to do to fix this is just head over to your start menu and search for settings. And we're going to click on the settings window. Now in the left hand side, go and click on system and then click on sound. Now next to output at the very top here, you want to go and make sure your speakers or headphones are selected. And you also want to make sure that this volume slider here is turned up like so. Now, once you've done that, you can scroll down to troubleshoot common sound problems, click on output devices, and then you can just go through the steps on this screen to try and troubleshoot any issues with your sound or speakers. So it's going to ask, do we have your consent to run automated diagnostics? Click on yes. And now it's going to perform a couple of tests on your computer to try and diagnose the issue. Now, if that method doesn't work for you, then we're gonna scroll down to advanced and click on more sound settings click on the playback tab at the very top here. And what you want to do is make sure that your speakers or headphones are enabled and turned on like this. So you can do that just by right clicking on your default device and clicking on enable. You also want to make sure to disable any devices that you're not using. So you can do that by right clicking and clicking on disable. And the only one that we should have enabled with a green tick here is our speakers or headphones. Now you also want to make sure that your default speakers are set to the default device. Now you can do that just by selecting them and clicking on this set default button and then go in and press in apply and okay. And once you've done that, you can then go and check to see if that solved your issue. Now, if that's not working, then head over to your start menu and just search for services and then click on the services window. Scroll right down to the bottom until you see a service called Windows Audio and we're going to double click on this service. Make sure the startup type is set to automatic and press apply and OK. You're then going to double click on it again. Make sure the service status is set to running. If it's currently stopped, then you can just press the start button and once again, press apply and OK. Finally, we're going to right click on Windows Audio and click on restart. Once you've done that, close out of this window, head over to the start menu and search for device manager and click on the device manager window. We're now going to expand the drop down next to audio inputs and outputs, right click on your speakers or headphones and click on update driver, then press search automatically for drivers. And once you've done that, close out of this window, then right click on your speakers again, click on update driver, click on browse my computer for drivers. Let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer, click on audio endpoint and press next. Next thing you need to do is expand the drop down next to sound, video and game controllers, right click on your Realtek audio device and click on update driver. Click on browse my computer for drivers. Let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer and select high definition audio device and click on next. Now, once you've done all of these steps, you can once again check to see if that solved your issue. Let me know in the comments if this did or didn't work for you and I'll see you in the next one.